Hello, welcome to part 27 of my Digimon World Walkthrough. Right, this part I'm going to try and get Pixie to the city. But it's night time, so if I hurry up and go straight there, I should just about make it. Now, he is random. He might turn up, he might not. So if he's not there, and I can't get him, I'll get Ninjamon instead. What I'm hoping he's there. He should be. Oh. Can't believe I made that error. Knock him out. Sonic Shadow. Please, man. That'll do. 400 bits, I think, or 300. Might get 300 bits for that. Come on, let's go. I want to go. Gotta go. Come on. In a rush. Right, it's not here yet, but it's not game over. Because if I do this, exit, then go back in, it sometimes works, apparently. No, it's not there. Exit again quick. Then go back in. Might work. Damn it! It's still dark, so I could still do it, because it has to be dark. Yeah. Not all hope is lost yet. But he should be here. He's not the easiest person to find. Is our lovely pixie man. What I might try and do is actually leave this way, then come back. So, exit, then come back in. There you go. No, doesn't want to show. Might not show then. It is, I think, like a one in four chance. Here he is. It's just random luck. Come here. Alright. Hey. Are you the one building the city? Yes. Huh? You're real lucky to meet me too, right? I don't look it, but I'm an ultimate this one. If you beat me, I'll help you. Okay, I accept. I've got plenty of human arms, so it doesn't matter if he completely just destroys me. I just gotta beat him. Pretty much. So if I get Megaton from him. Uh, poison. Get in. Oh, he's fast. He's trying to jump in. And Megaton punch him. Oh, he's too fast. He's on the back. He's on the back of Oh, that's bull. That's what he's doing. This is now he's in the fight. Right, okay. Uh, no. This is what I did. Now I'm probably confusing as well. Oh, another ball. Oh, this is so annoying. Thankfully, I was changing the ball So it didn't actually hit me. Got him. Oh, damn it.
I lost my advantage because that stupid thing. Nancy bomb. I'll do some damage. Every time it does that move, it takes a while. Oh, that's not, no, it's still got it. That's not bad, 1,100, that's alright, I'll take that. Two more things I've got in beat. Probably one more thing I've got in beat, actually, because... Uh, try dying. 170. Once you get on the effect, you're alright. Pixiemon probably is the best Digimon. Because he knows so much stuff, like he can he can confuse your know, these attacks are fast. He can pause and like, it knows Bulb Whips can do like 2000 damage if it hits a him up to the top actually probably the same bit. That picks him on strong. If it wasn't night time that was in the day I probably would have trained him a bit but because you have to get him like in this time of the day. It's a bit of pain. Come on, man -a man. That'll do some damage as well. Oh, I could die from that. Just 1,500 here. Don't be tight. Don't be tight. Oh, I'm getting mad. Okay. I don't think I got that full. No, I think I only got it to like. Not full. Never mind. Get him on it. Oh, he's got to finish the game. At least I can MP floppy at this point. Wow. Got him. This is crucial, really, getting picked him on. Because you get, if you unlock him, it has the training manual. I got 3,600 bits and all. But yeah, Pixelmon's probably the best Digimon in like the entire game. Well, I'll last well, I'll see you in the city. Apart from probably Machine Drummond, but the best recruiting Digimon is probably Pixelmon. Plus Machine Drummond is technically a Mega anyway, so it shouldn't actually really count. So the best the best game the, the best Digimon probably in the game is probably Pixelmon. A lot of people say Gurumon's very good, but I've looked on the internet and his finish is dreadful. Pixiemon's just much better, so I'd say Pixiemon's probably best. Then a lot of it's in um, Mega Drummond's pretty good because it knows ice. It knows a lot of ice attacks which paralyze you. So I'd probably say Pixiemon's first, then probably Mega Drummond is second. But I thought Phoenix Mon wasn't bad. I would say Phoenix Mon so far to be my strongest ultimate out of Mame Mon and Phoenix Mon. Ma uh, Phoenix Mon was powerful. It was quite fast. Oh, I forgot to say in my previous video I got Monochrome Mon to the city, which is actually serving now. So. Oh, I didn't mean to skip that um, talking. Damn it. Right, okay. Well, I've got five of those because I've got my ass warped. I'll buy like seven of them. See, now I can get a restore. I can get a protect and a restore due to thingy. I can buy double flops as well. Plus, I think a uh, large MP it gives you. So, it gives you like four really good healing items. 
I'll get a portable party in all, because I might have to go to Factorial Town later on, just to learn a few moves. So that's uh, Pixie Bond to the city, so my rating now should be 58. We're getting close now to ending the game. We're, we don't need that many more. I'm only resting to get his um, health up by 500. Oh no, you don't. Oh, you don't. Well, I just bought five healing items, so I should be able to go and fight Ninja Man in a minute. And I don't think I picked up the chip. I can't remember if I picked it up or not. I might have picked it up, but I had it. I can't remember doing it. Did I pick it up? I don't... Uh, yes, I did. I picked it up. I can't remember doing it, but I must have done. Because I don't think I've, I've only got Manicurum on to the city before this, so I must have done it. Oh, I was too busy talking. Yes, yeah, so I've got quite a lot of chips. I've got two offensive, one defense, two brain. It's HP I've mainly got. I've got five of them. So, yeah, any pretty much any Digimon could have. I could probably get maximum HP for any for like whatever Digimon. I mean, my main one's got 2,600, but I fed him all five chips, he could have like 5,000 HP. You could probably go into the, into the dimension with 5,000 HP and just like literally win everything. But that's a bit boring. So I'm going to try and fight. I'm hoping Ninjamon's around. This won't be that long video really, because I've only got to beat Pixamon and Ninjamon, that's it. Uh, Ninjamon should be down here, because you have to get 45 points to the city. I don't know if there's times. No. There we go. This is Ninjamon. I think you have to have 45 points, a bit like Vademon. It's hard really to get anything. I'm called Ninjamon. You're Dan, you must be Dusty. You're famous even as far as Ninja Village, except my chance to fight. Sure. You don't actually see Ninja Village on this thing. Instead of him actually coming all the way down here, you should actually go to Ninja Village, but there ain't one. Yes, see? Ooh. Magna Bomb. Batman video games, you see, before, now we have DLC, but then, back in the day, there's, well, we well, weren't bothered about making DLC, we just waiting, we just waiting for the video game, so that's much, that's a much better idea. Massive video back now, just to bother, include something, that'll do it for We're about even actually. I might win with that and to a healing. But I might get my finisher and I might be able to do 1153 damage. Gotta get this full, gotta get this full. Oh, damn it. oh I still won anyway. You must have you must not have very good defense or is weak against machines or is weak against fire slash machines. Two thousand bit, that's alright. Ninjamon drop quick chip, alright. 
That's actually quite rare. Quick trip, you can get many of them. You're just as strong as they say you are. Please make me your disciple. Disciple? Well, I don't do that. But you can help us in the city. Okay, that's your training. I'll work hard. I can't actually remember what he does. I think he might sell items. I don't actually remember. It's amazing how many people actually just work in a shop in this game. Like the developers couldn't be bothered to think. I mean, the medical centre is a good idea. The restaurant's a good idea. The shop is a good idea. The arena is a good idea, obviously, because that's what they do, the fight. But, I don't know, I don't know what else they could have done, I guess. Um, I suppose there isn't really much. I don't know about all this. I know he's a professional. He's very good. It's difficult to get to the city and all. Ninja one came here, talked about training. It's a good a good to see hard workers. There you go. I don't know actually know what Ninja Mon actually does. I don't think he improves the gym. I think he might work in the shop, I can't remember. I actually do not remember. Ah, here we go. We can go down here now. Now, Pixiemon's behind the counter, I think, so I wonder. Here he is. I know about items. There are 128 kinds of items in all. 32 are food. I don't know how many. Right items grow naturally in some areas and can't be found in others. Yeah, he can fight, that is true. Does he just talk? Well, looks like he just tells you what to do. That was a good time, that was a good investment. What does he buy? Uh, kind of useful, I guess, the one where he was up with your life as you're walking, but for 2,000 quid, it's a bit friggin' expensive. So Ninjamon basically does nothing. Birdrum I used to use all the time when I was younger. Because I basically just sat there and fought every time. I'd have a fight, go to sleep. Have a fight, have a sleep. Go, and that was all I did. Quick chip. Yes. I think I've only got the one quick chip, yeah. I don't think you get many quick chips. I think there's only about two, like, quick chips. I think Ninja Man's got one. There's another one. I can't remember where it is. I think there's only two quick chips. You might get one in the dimension. In a, in a hidden box, I think. But I don't know about that. Or your fight might be when you fight Megadramon. When you get one. I think there's only two quick trips. Two quick chips. 
in the entire game, which is like 100 speed. Speed is one thing you don't really get much on. This lag is proper annoying. Sorry about this, people. Come on, stop lagging. Come on, behave. Why is it doing that? It's only going like half speed. Ah, oh, hang on, let's fix it for a little bit. Sorry about that, review this. Right, back on the road. Right, that'll do, 2999, that's not bad. That'll do, 418. Two stats in the 500, so that's pretty good. That's, uh, that's quite um, a strong dizzy one, really. When you think about it. Um, how much, uh, how many points have I got? Player 33,000. I need 50,000 for the training manual. Make sure you don't eat the training manual when you buy it. Because you do, you just wasted 50,000 bits. I know that because I once, the first time I played this one, I accidentally ate the damn thing. So don't eat it, you have to carry it around, don't eat it. Um, I don't want this item shop, what are we doing? Another thing I've got to do eventually, after I probably beat the final boss, is buy loads of Digimon cards and just complete the deck. Because I haven't got many, I've only got about half of them. It's only, it's the 20th day though, so I can't really buy any more cards yet. I'll probably do that later, the Digimon cards, it's not important. I'll buy the training manual first, then I'll get loads of items and stuff, and then I'll probably, I'll probably get 99 um, healing of each, and then I'll probably do it then. And I've got some Digimushrooms already, I've got, I've got 11, so if I go to Friesland I'll trade them in for the medium recoveries. And so that's a nice little trick. I don't really want to uh, use my uh, dizzy mushroom. I've got three small meats. I've got some money because small meats are only 50, so I want my ultimate fades. How old is he? 15, so I've probably got tomorrow, the next day, and then he'll probably fade in the morning. So I've probably got two days out of him, so it's not too bad. I might go to Friesland anyway tomorrow because I've got to fight Gururu Man. So my plan is to fight Gururu Man in Friesland. So but he's quite strong. The first fight's quite easy, it's the second one. I mean, 3,128 is probably just enough HP. It's the 2,400 MP I'm going to probably struggle with. You'll probably need 3,000 and... You probably need 4,000 non HP and 4 and 3,000 MP. The only thing is you're always supposed to sleep at this time. So, it's a bit of a wait, so I'll have to probably train a little bit first, have a rest, then walk Friesland, then I'll fight Gururuman. So, yeah, on the next part, I'll fight Gururuman, and then I'll have to wait a day again, then refight him and beat him again, and then he'll join the city. So, in the next part, I'll fight Gururuman, so I'll see you for that. Bye!